all right hi guys um it is anna and i'm coming to you with a video um i have been gone for quite some time but i had a little chance and it's not like i have not been doing projects um but i've picked up some new hobbies including sewing and quilting so and of course you know my job so i've been pretty busy but one thing i have worked on this weekend is we have valentine's day coming up later on this week and so i thought i'd do something sweet i actually still follow my blogs and my vlogs on youtube and one of my favorite crafting kate um she did this cute little thing on cards that her and her husband like to do to each other and she had come up with this little cute idea on um doing valentine's cards little valentine cards you know like doing a countdown to valentine's day so i did something similar um i didn't start from the first of february um what i did is i s plan on starting tomorrow um uh, right now it's the ninth it's a sunday night so i plan on leaving a little treat and a little card for my husband leading up to valentine's day so i'm going to show you that today i'm showing you my little cards um i did i did three by three cards and i also decorated the envelope as well and as you can see um I have written on top countdown to valentine's day and it's day number five until then and I think I kind of did this a little wrong I should have done four because day zero is valentine's day but who cares so anyway so you know I used my pen to write that down and I use these little stickers came in one of the studio calico kits and these are like little puffy um number stickers and I used some washi tape. It gave me a chance to use my, my washi tape to seal it. And so I just kind of picked Valentine theme ones for this. Um, so this is the day number five. So this is for Monday. This is tomorrow. And then this is a Studio Calico chipboard heart sticker. And then this is my little card. Um, these little, um, this little mailbox, um, it's part of the Martha Stewart um, sticker, um, a, um, sticker set that I got from... Um, Michaels. It's a three sticker set. Um, I think I put it away so I can't show it to you because it's across my craft room. Um, but it gave me a chance to use um, my um, lawn fawn stamps. You know the one that has the mailbox as well and letters and has like a little postcard stamp as well. I hadn't used that stamp set at all so it just gave me the chance to use that. So it had the sentiment sending love your way and I used the mailbox sticker on it. It's a 3D sticker and then the little envelope one and then I stabbed a little envelope as well. And the little background paper because the card itself is cream colored cardstock. Um, the background I believe this came from um, Bow Bunny. Uh, Bow Bunny's um, last year's um, 2013's their Valentine um, or their yeah their Valentine's Day collection then um, which I hadn't used so it gave me a chance to use that as well but this is for day number five and I thought this was really cute so let me show you day number four day number four is this little card here and this is the envelope here's the washi tape I used and these I also found, this is from Recollections, the Michaels brand, and um, they have these little kind of stitched, um, kind of stick out um, little flags or banners, I should say. And this one says, I love you. And this is for day number four. So this is for Tuesday and the washi tape to hold it. And this background paper is also Bow Bunny. Um, I also use some of my Studio Calico. Um, I use some of the, you know, the, from the, what's that collection that came out? Atlantic. Um, Atlantic last year they came out with this dark brown um, wood veneer um, hearts and these hearts came out a long time ago I forgot with what paper line they came out with and this is an Amy Tangerine um, three-dimensional sticker this came out with her I believe this was the cut and paste from last year or last season and this rub-on it's kind of a little hard to see but it's a gold rub-on I mean it says I love 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 you um, and this is from Pebbles this is from their what collection is this doesn't say but it comes from this Pebbles one right here I got them I got them in golden and white so I'm finally using them all right, so this is for day number four. Put this to the side here. And here's my card and envelope for day number three. And here's the envelope. Um, so again, I used the puffy sticker. And these stickers actually come from the Echo Park, their Valentine's Day um, 
collection from last year that I never used. I loved it, loved it, and I really what I used was the crepe paper one. I didn't use the Echo Park one. That's the one I kind of stuck to. Um, so I didn't buy any Valentine's Day themed um, collections this year. They they were pretty cute. Oh, actually I lied. I bought the crepe paper one. <laughs> but um, I, I this is from last year. This is Echo Parks and the their sticker sheet that comes with their. Um, they're 12 by 12 paper pack. This is what this comes from. So the heart says, I love you more than stars above, which is very sweet. And then February 14th, which I like the little banner idea on the corner. I know it wasn't, you know, so this is for Wednesday. So not February 14th yet. And then I use the same washi tape, you know, to, to steal it. And then here's the little card. And this sticker, what I did is um, I used that powder tool to take off the glue. And then I put it on some you know, um, three dimensional dots on here, but I like what it says, a true love story never ends. And then I put two, um, two pearl brads and the brads are also from the, the brads from the actual collection as well. And so was the background paper. So that is for Wednesday. So Thursday, you will get this card and here's the envelope. And this still uses that um, Echo Park collection. I used the little heart banner, same thing. I used the powder tool and then I put it on three dimensionals. And then the rest of it, the flowers, I just put it, um, I just use a sticker straight on there and it's for day number two until Valentine's Day. And then I used this red with white polka dots, so washi tape. And I put the flowers on here because my little card, I bought this also, this is also a long font stamp set and I never used it, um, but it's called Be Mine. Um, and I love that little bee. I mean, once I saw this, I had to get this. And of course, this is the first time I'm using it. So I did the flowers, I did the bee, leaving the little heart um, shaped little thing behind him. And then I used some, um, I think these are Casey and Company. I got these at Joann's a while back. And those are just the little rhinestones to go on there just to give it a little bling. Um, and this was on white cardstock. And then I also, I edged it with Memento ink. Um, they had like a pink color. Let me see if I have it. It's this one, the Rosebud. This is what I used. So I did that along the edge. And so this is for Thursday. So Friday on Valentine's Day, this is what he will be getting. So see how I put day number one? It really should say day number zero, but I didn't do that. And in fact, I think Craft and Kate, I think what she did is she actually started like day number zero and then worked her way up. But anyway, I don't think there's a wrong way of doing it. Um, and then I used these, I believe these are pink paisley. These are... Um, I don't know if they're Pink Paisley or Heidi Swap, um, but these are the Copper Hearts. Um, I haven't used those, so I was glad to use them. And this one is in craft, as you can see. And then this is the washi tape I used to seal it, or I'm gonna use to seal it. And this is another lawn font stamp that I use. This is the Love You Tons. This is um, fairly new. Um, this came out um, a few months ago. And I also used the die set for it as well. It's hard to see the little elephants because of the, um, the pattern paper I use, I try to use the light one. The pattern paper does come from that Bow Bunny collection again. Um, and then I used a heart from the Pink Paisley Valentine's Day collection and their ephemera pack from last year. And this is a crepe paper um, banner. I had to cut the edges off because it was sticking out so it looks a little silly at the end. That says Happy Valentine's Day. It's one of those stitched banners. And this is from their um, Valentine crepe paper. And then this You and Me is actually a Brad. This one is actually from My Mind's Eye. It's from their Chalk Studio. And that is it. So what I plan to do with these is I plan to, I haven't thought about it, but I got to figure out tonight. Um, I plan to either um, put it in his truck since I leave before he does, either put it in his truck with some Hershey Kisses every day, um, and just as a little treat, um, he doesn't take a lunch every day, so I don't know if, I don't think putting it in his lunchbox will help. Um, but I think what I'm going to do is just leave one in his truck every day and hope he likes it. Well, guys, you know, that's about it. Um, I hope to be doing more videos. I did revamp my blog, you know, so I kind of changed it up a bit. And I don't know if I'd be able to post every week like I was doing last year. And I think it's been almost a year since I've posted on my blog. Um, but, you know, when I do get something done and I have the time to video it and photograph it, I will definitely put it up there. All right. Well, hope you guys have a good evening. Bye.